Welcome to another Python tutorial. Today we are looking at the string find method. By definition, the find method finds the first occurrence of the specified substring. If no value is found, the method will return negative one. So this is how the syntax looks like. As we can see, we have three parameters. The first parameter is required and it specifies the value to search for. Two other parameters are optional, where the first one specifies the start of the search, the default value 0 or beginning of the string, and the second parameter is, uh, signifies where to end the search. By default, this is the end of the string. So the method will return the lowest index in string where substring is found, such that substring is contained within the string. The optional arguments start and end are interpreted as in slice notation and the method will return negative one on failure. So let's look at some examples. In the first example, we are looking for a character E. So if you run this example, we can see that the method will return the lowest index, which in this case is one. Now in the second example, we are looking for a substring apple. So if you run this example, we can see that uh, the method will return negative one, meaning that in this search area, the uh, substring apple has not been found but if we change this to negative one uh, which is end of the string we should be able to see the index at which the substring starts now in this last example we are just looking for a comma in the string and if we run this we can see that the first um, substring that was found the index of the substring has been returned which is six, All right? So this is the find method, find method. It is very simple. So thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.